a strange product to share with you today. A few days ago, I was scrolling through Facebook and I saw that a friend of mine posted about a color-changing lipstick. Now that's not new technology or anything, I mean, brands everywhere are coming out with this kind of thing. But this one was different because it has henna in it. So I was really excited to try this out, I immediately went on to eBay and ordered it, and now it's here. This is the Hair, as in H-A-R-E, Magic Moroccan Color Changing Lipstick. Now what's cool about this one is, it is actually bright green. And so you're supposed to put this on and somehow it adapts to a nice matte pink kind of color or rosy color. I just got this in the mail yesterday, so I haven't tried it out yet. As you can see, I'm not wearing any lipstick right now, so I thought I would try it out with you guys. First, about the packaging, it is green, as you would expect, uh, but it's made completely of plastic. And on the inside, the part that you screw the lipstick up from is a little bit loose, so when you... So when you screw it up, it sometimes will fall back in, but... I mean, I only paid about $10 for this on eBay, so I wasn't expecting anything completely extraordinary. But I do think it is pretty cute. It has little gold butterflies around the lid. Okay, I'm so excited to try this out now. I wonder if it swatches on my hand. I want to see what it does when I put it on my hand. Hmm. You can't really see it on my hand. I just swatched right here. And it's a little bit pink, um, but it's not, it's not anything you can really see. So it looks like this is going to be kind of a sheer color. Okay, I just put it on my bottom lip so we can kind of get the contrast with my upper lip. It looks like it almost immediately kind of made this reddish, kind of rosy pink color. It's kind of nice. It does look very natural. It looks like it might get a little bit darker though, so we'll have to see what it looks like at the end, but I'm just going to do my top lip. It actually feels really moisturizing, like it almost feels like a lip balm to me, which is pretty cool because it's, I mean, if this is going to stain my lips and last all day, I kind of don't want it to be something that's going to be really drying. It does have a little bit of a shine to it right now, but we'll see if later in the day that goes away. So I'll check in with you guys a little bit later to see how it does. Okay, so just in the last, I think, 10 minutes, this definitely got very pink. I don't know if you can really tell on the camera how different it is, but it looks more like a berry now than it did when I first put it on. And I also have to say, the swatch on my hand got much darker. So it's interesting, it actually makes a noticeable color on the skin too, which makes me kind of wonder, now call me crazy, but I'm wondering if this could also be sort of a staining blush. First I want to see how it actually washes off my hand later, but it seems like that actually might be a really cool way to use this product as well. Overall I'd say this is a really cool product, I mean, imagine people's faces when I pull this out of my purse and start putting this all over my face. I'll leave the seller I got this from down below, but if they're sold out you may have to do a little bit of searching to make sure you're finding the right product. Hopefully you'll be able to find it if you're looking for it, and I really hope you like this review and you want to try it out. Thanks for watching. Thank you.